So I want to put out a really quick theory about Ruin since it's out now. If you don't want spoilers to Ruin, I suggest you should click off. Also, please keep in mind, this is a theory, not a fact. You don't have to believe me and it's all opinion. I'm sure there's many ways to prove and disprove my theory. If you want to discuss your thoughts and your beliefs, you're more than welcome to. I won't debate, but I'll happily read and understand where you're coming from. Like I said, it's this is a quick theory, a pure speculation. There may be mistakes and there may be holes, as this is my first FNAF theory, on video at least. Well, anyways, let's just jump into it. Spoilers ahead, click off now. Let me just straight up say it. I believe that the security system that's trying to keep the Mimic at bay, aka Mexes, is Glamrock Bonnie's AI. Okay, just hear me out, hear me out. Previously, in the main game of Security Beach, we learned that Freddy and Bonnie were very close, as Freddy as Freddy expresses grief towards body being missing. I do not come up here anymore. I miss him. And in Ruin, you go when you go to Bonnie's room, you read a poster that says, You and me forever and ever love Freddy! <gasps> yes, I'm using Darko clips with this because I watched this playthrough and I do not have the game. But isn't it just heartwarming? You and me... Forever and ever. Love, Freddy. That, that just has my heart. It clearly shows just how close they were to one another. So me thinks if they were close, chances are Bonnie was just as nice and helpful as Freddy. Not to mention, throughout the game, you're collecting these items in AR while using the Vanny mask. And some of those items are Bonnie related. Hell, we even get to find out just how Bonnie looks like in Security Breach in, well, cartoon form. He's got such a cute little design. So, this tells me that Bonnie has some sort of significance in Ruin, or at least in Security Breach in general, as expected. It feels as if it's building up for the player to finally meet Bonnie at last, after how long? But of course, we didn't. Or did we? Well, ladies and gentlemen and everyone in between, as I stated before, I believe that the security system trying to stop the mimic and trying to stop you is Bonnie's AI. Now I believe this for a couple of reasons. We don't know what happened to Bonnie throughout Security Breach. The only explanation is the theory that Monty had destroyed Bonnie due to Vanny's influence, or Vanny destroyed him to build Peepaw. But we do know that Bonnie is supposedly gone because, well, Freddy said so himself that... There is no rabbit at the Mega Pizza Plex. Not anymore. So we don't know where Bonnie exactly is. We just know he's gone. Or it's to be believed that he is. He could still be out there, we just don't know. Another reason being that Mexus looks a lot like a bon bunny. Why? I don't think it's glitched yet because why would he protect the pizza plex if he is, wants to take things over? I mean, it could be, but I don't know. Mexus is a bunny for a reason, and the only bunny we do know of that's not glitch trap is Bonnie. And Mexus looks more blue than purple. And judging by Bonnie's merchandise and how his cartoon form looks like, he's also blue. Personally, I think he should be purple like the OG Bonnie, but oh well. So my reasons that Glamrock Bonnie and Mexis are the same character is the fact we've been seeing Bonnie this whole time. All around us for once. From merchandise to neon lights. I think that he's there somehow. The fact that they're both blue bunnies. The fact that Bonnie's been missing this whole time. And the fact that Mexis is a good guy. Much like what Bonnie seems to be, given the fact that he's trying to prevent the Mimic from escaping and how Freddy talks of Bonnie. Now the question is, how or why? Well, this is purely a thought. We know that the Mimic's been there for a long while, but for how long? The whole time? Could be. So why Bonnie? Why is Bonnie the vessel for Mexus? How could he be? This, theory, this is where the theory can fall apart, but I'll continue. Maybe the Mimic was there when the Pizza Plex was built. Maybe it hadn't activated until perhaps Vanny came around, or Vanny found it and transferred over to the Pizza Plex. Whatever the case may be, Fazbear's Entertainment knew of this. They knew it was a danger. I mean, Gregory said it, said it himself. It's been trapped down here a really long time. There you go! Yep, there you go! The Nexus security program was designed to keep it hidden. But you shut down the security. And now it's free. When they discovered it, it could have been around the time Bonnie was supposedly destroyed, or maybe they took and maybe they took his AI chip and used it as a basis for Mexus, and thus the Mexus security program was born. I don't know, maybe I'm crazy, but I just thought it would be a cool thing if that was Bonnie. I'll likely need more evidence to prove my point, but I really want to share my thoughts. It just makes sense to me, and I could be very wrong. And that's okay if I am. It was a fun thought. It could be a cool AU thing. I don't know. But, but yeah, I just wanted to make this 
do this quick theory. Remember, this is just a theory. A game th Yeah, no, just kidding. It's just a theory, not a fact. Just to get some gears turning for possibilities. I could be wrong, I could be right. Either way, this was fun to make. I hope you enjoyed this mess. I've been a, um, sort of dragon wolf, and I'll see you guys in after my nap. Bye-bye.